So just a quick note before we get started guys, for those of you who don't like the travel vlogs and prefer the car content, please skip this video, there's plenty more car content on the channel and there's more car content coming your way, especially from the classic car show at Morgan last week, that video is still to be edited and uploaded. So if you do prefer the car content, please skip this video, but for those of you who do like the travel vlogs, please stick around. Can't guarantee we will see cars, but there has been some nice cars on the high street overnight. So hopefully we'll see some more tonight. But hey YouTube, welcome back to the channel. Welcome back to another video. Today we are at Much Wenlock, staying at the Wenlock Studios. Let me just grab the book here. Wenlock Studios, it's a self-catering apartment here in Much Wenlock. Uh, we haven't traveled too far, it's very close to the local area. And this is the first time that we've actually gone away since March. Uh, I went away for my birthday in March and a week after we were put into lockdown. So this is the first time we've gone away for a weekend since March. And it feels good to be out, it feels good to have a weekend away. Of course it's not too far away, I have driven past this place many times before on the way to Shrewsbury. But this time we're staying here and we're going to explore the local area. So today the plan is to take a look around the high street and then go up to the Wenlock Priory which is a... a like an old castle. Uh, so we're going to check that out today and really explore the local area. As you can see the view out the back there of the apartment and if we come through to the front here you'll be able to see the view of the high street. Really nice apartment as you can see. Really nice bedroom, really nice view. So if we come over here you can see the, uh, the view of the high street. Wooden beams in the ceiling as well. Very, very nice apartment and we've really enjoyed our first night here. So it's our first night and we're here till Sunday. So we'll be checking out the local area, going to little places in between and really just having a really chill weekend really and, uh, and, and enjoying ourselves. So without further ado, let's, uh, let's go outside and check out what much Wenlock has to offer.
Brighton flat. Today we went off to the zoo. Uh, it's a small zoo on the other side of Telford. Never really been there before and really did enjoy it. It's called Who Farm uh, something zoo. It's like a petting zoo basically. They've also got other animals like wolves um, and all sorts there. It was really a great experience. It's pre book only uh, so it was nice and secure as well. Uh, but we're back at the flat now. I thought while we're here uh, um, just give you a bit of a tour of where we are. And uh, as you can see, it's very nice, very nice indeed. We were going to go for a hotel, but with everything that's going on in the world at the moment, we thought self catering would be the best option. And uh, and yeah, it's great to know this place is here and quite a nice view out the back there, which leads out into the driveway. Uh, but if I turn the camera around, I'll give you a view of where we're staying. So the entrance is down there. Nice mirror at the top of the stairs here. We head over here. It's very nice indeed. This Lamborghini Reventon toy, uh, I picked it up from the market just outside the window, is a bit damaged, there's a crack on the windscreen and the paint is bubbling down here but I believe I can fix it and uh, the wheels are a bit sticky but I believe I can fix that, the doors lift up, the boot lifts up, but uh, yeah it was nice and cheap as well but I think I can fix that up. Nice view out the window. TV in the kitchen, the owner uh, kindly left us some cake and you can see the rating there from booking.com. We head over here into the bedroom, bathroom, pretty self-explanatory really. And here's the bedroom, nice desk area there, we turn the, turn the light on the light switches behind the door. And there's the market hall there. Right on that table there is where I brought the Lamborghini toy from. So it's right outside the bedroom window. Come over here, you can see a bit more of the high street, the market hall, and the library in the back over there as well. So this is where we are staying. Uh, I do prefer it compared to a hotel, especially with everything that's going on in the world at the moment. It's just nice to be somewhere uh, where there's no one else. You're, you tidy up yourself. Uh, I know a lot of the hotels aren't doing room service, uh, but still it's nice to have somewhere where you can cook and you can clean for yourself. Uh, it's nice to have that feature, especially in these uncertain times. But uh, but yeah, we'll just go relax now and we're going to head out to the local shop and get some food for tonight. And then tomorrow we'll be checking out at 10am in the morning. I'm not sure what we're going to be doing, not 100% sure if I'll be filming tomorrow or not, but uh, we'll see. But we've really enjoyed our stay here at Much Wenlock. Uh, I used to drive through here all the time on the way to Shrewsbury, uh, didn't really stop, we just carried on the main road, which is like a massive bend up there, um, so you just drive past it and you wouldn't really realise this was here, but uh, it came up on booking.com so we thought we'd give it a try, and we actually do really like this place, uh, it reminds us a lot of Ambleside just because of how small and quiet it is, um, there's not really any big high street names here, of course you've got the bank and you've got the spa, but main mainly it's small small uh, shops basically and uh, very nice butchers, very nice Chinese takeaway here as well um, so yeah it's very it's very nice. So at the start of the video um, this video isn't really going to appeal to everyone you know my car my channel's mainly based around cars really um, so this video is sort of a bit of a strange one. I used to do travel vlogs a lot back when I used to travel back when it was simpler times um, so I used to do a lot of travel vlogs and a lot of car content as well uh, but over recent months I haven't really done a travel vlog. The last one I did was when we went to Silverstone for my birthday in March but, um, but yeah I haven't really done a travel vlog since so I'm a bit nervous, a bit rusty but, um, but yeah it's, uh, it's nice to be back travelling for a little while and who knows as maybe, maybe as the year progresses maybe we'll be able to get back out there a bit more and travel but if not maybe next year but we'll see we'll see what the next year and the new year brings should i say but um yeah it's good to be back and doing a bit more of a travel vlog uh not much car related this weekend um but i'll see what i can do for next weekend or see what i can do in terms of car content during the week but thank you very much for watching and i'll see you all in my next car related video